get comfortable. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm back and it feels different, I will say. It feels really different only because I have not been in front of the camera to vlog in such a long time. And excuse anything you hear in the background, that's my dog downstairs barking if you can hear. But anyways, <laughs> hey y'all, hey y'all, it's your girl Jakari Arian, it's your girl Jakari Arian, and I'm back, and I'm back with another video. Well, I should say my first video to start Vlogmas off, right? Because it is Vlogmas Day 1. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. Yeah, it feels weird to be in front of the camera again, I will say that. But, for Vlogmas Day 1, I thought it would be the best idea to kind of give y'all an update. Like, what the hell has been going in my, going on in my life? And where have I been, right? Y'all probably like, this girl, she stay talking about how she gonna be consistent, how she gonna stay on YouTube, and how she gonna do this and do this and don't be doing nothing. Well, I've taken off work. I may work a couple shifts here and there because my work life is pretty flexible now. But I've taken off work because... December, I have committed to myself to give myself time to do Vlogmas, to commit to you all, and just to like start my own business, broaden my horizon, because I really want to take this serious. I really want to make money off of YouTube. You know, that was one of my all time long term goals for the future. Futuristically, I see myself on YouTube, a beauty influencer, just an influencer as a whole, and then on all my social media platforms. So I took December. Since it's like the best time of year, everybody's feeling giving, in a good mood. It's my favorite holiday. It's around the corner for my birthday. And just because I feel like this month I could be the most stablest in it. And you know the most consistent with you having to post a vlog every day, of course. Which, by the way, I'm in the middle of getting my um, intro and outro a new banner made for December. I have stepped my game up and let somebody else do it for me, so... I don't know if I'll have it by tonight, but if so, I might have to tweak it here and there. So whenever I get it up, you guys will either have it up for day two, y'all will have two, or day three, and y'all will have three vlogs coming to you, period. But, yeah. So, I guess we could start about what I want to do on YouTube. So, I do want to do some vlogs. I still want to do beauty, as y'all can see. Beats of the Gods by me, of course. Um, um, what else do I want to do? A new thing I want to do is girl talks, okay? Girl talks, because I feel like it's good to sit down and just, us girls talk, like, give each other's tips and tricks, talk about mental health, building each other up, self-confidence, all that, baby. Girl talks. So, I do need y'all to drop down below some, um, topics y'all want to hear about, because I'm thinking about Vlogmas Day 3, doing a girl talk, or a... Just a little chat, you know, just us toxic, talking amongst us girls, you know, and the things we go through. Because right now I'm dealing with Mother Nature and I will say dealing with her, I don't change my mood, but, you know, I'm a woman. So, you know, we might be able to give each other's tips and trips, tips and tricks for cramps and stuff. Because I know exercising is a plus because that relieves you of your um, abdominal pain. But... Anyways, back to the life update because I love to get sidetracked. Um, I'm also, as y'all know, I am a CNA. Um, I also have got my esthetician license and I'm so excited about that because I plan on opening my own business. Um, but right now I might actually work side by side with um, a spa that wants me to come. Let me turn that off. That's kind of rude. But let me make sure that's not for my... Okay, that wasn't for me. Made sure that wasn't for my intro and outro. But yeah, I am just in the midst of getting that together. I'm going to be doing a shoot, so that'll also be a part of Vlogmas where you guys come with me so I can take pictures for my own brand because I do. I want to work for myself. I'm so tired of working for other people. I do enjoy my enjoy and adore my job being a companion as a CNA, you know. Just being there for people that don't have anybody and just taking care of someone because who doesn't want to be taken care of, you know? Especially if you can't do for yourself. But I do want to work for myself. That is my ultimate goal. 
I'm a natural born hustler. I'm an independent woman, just like my mother. You know, shout out to her because that's where I get all these skills and different things from and dipping my hands into different things, but especially to work for myself. She has been a business owner since I've been alive, probably even before I was alive, but that's all I know. And it's her working for herself and her being her own boss. And that's what I want to achieve. So, I will tell you the name of my business. It is called Rebellious Beauty Bar. Notice how it's rebellious because I am like the biggest rebel out of all three of my mom's kids. I rebel against everything. I kind of do things when I want to, how I want to, and yeah, whatever I want. <laughs> that is so bad, but the name just fits me so well. And you know, one of my truest sayings is, for it is to rebel, rebel in your own beauty because there shouldn't be a you can't do this or you can't do that or you can't have what you want you know we all have goals we all have goals in skincare in the beauty industry pretty period if you're going to get your hair done your nails done you have a way that you want it done and it is always possible at least to get as close as possible and that is my goal to give to young mature women young and mature i should say but to everyone as a whole just period so yes that will be coming up and i'm so excited and one thing that's behind my brand that's gonna stand out the most is a butterfly because that is my how do i say this should i say like my animal nature or my alter ego whatever but a butterfly represents me so well for many of reasons that I'm not going to get into, but you know, it starts off ugly and it has to grow. And when it grows and when it gets there and it keeps growing, it ultimately just keeps becoming progressively something more and more beautiful. Beauty beyond the eye, okay? Look at the wings. So delicate, so textured, so elegant. Like, oh, I just am such a butterfly. But... <laughs> Other than that, another thing that is new, going back to my mommy, she has opened up a restaurant, guys. It's been open for a couple months now, but it is doing very, very well. Super successful, and yeah, y'all should come try some of that Esther's Soul Food. That's what it's called. Esther's Kitchen or Esther's Soul Food. One of those. But I'll definitely leave a link in the bottom, in the description down below. Y'all can see it's been so long since I've vlogged. But... To where it is if you're in the south carolina area you know columbia area sand hills come try it out because it's some really yummy food probably the best food that you'll find in columbia as a whole that's my opinion for real for real and i'm just being honest but um yeah so she did that and she's also about to open a 35 and up club you know dirty 30s older people because like i said I guess peop older people are tired of hanging out with the younger crowd. They do not want to deal with us any longer, okay? They don't want no smoke with us. They don't want none of that. They don't even want to chill with us no more. If y'all know this, like, if you've ever been in clubs, like, when I used to go partying, because I haven't partied in, I don't know how long, like, going to clubs and actually hanging out. But older people, like, unless they want to be on BS, they're not really there because it's like the younger crowd, we come with all this drama, all this, all that, want to fight and all this stupid stuff. So they don't want to be concerned with that. So my mom was like, let me open a club for them to come chill, you know, after work, come get a couple drinks, you know, chill with people their age and not people that are so rowdy and stuff. But it's going to be really elegant, really sexy, really nice, like gentle, dark vibes. It's, it's. The picture she has is very A1. I love it. But what else is new? Um, I've talked about that. That Oh, yeah. And my mommy, she's getting married. Which I am going to create my own. Um, I've already started vlogging it because obviously we've already been in the process of it. But her wedding is 02-22-22. How beautiful is that? I want some years like that. Like, my wedding day has to, you know, coexist like that, coincide. Whatever, whatever word you use, but it has to be like that. But I'm so excited for that. I've created my own series for that that I'll be posting along the way of things that we've done to get where we are. And I actually, 
yeah. So I cannot wait to post that and let you guys see that because it's going to be freaking beautiful. You know, and I'm so excited for it. And I'm just so happy for her. I'm so happy for my mom. She's so happy and it's just a beautiful thing. It makes me happy. Um, you guys are probably going to ask about my mental. My mental has been pretty, pretty well. Actually, I asked for some Instagram questions and I think you guys had answered them. Well, a couple people have answered and I think that was one of the questions. I have to see who asked. But, hold on, I'm getting a phone call. Give me one second. <laughs> Five hours later. Okay, so back, I don't know where I left off. Oh, the questions. Let me find them in my phone. But I believe somebody asked about my mental health. How was I doing? Let me see here. Got a lot of pictures to go through, so give me one second, but I know I screenshotted it. one of the questions that someone asked about my mental update so mental update mental check-in I am doing fabulous I'm doing way better than ever um, yeah that's what I can say my mental is I'm very healthy I'm very happy I'm very excited to see things that are coming in for me that God has to bring for me and yeah I'm excited to be back on this journey, but be back on this journey whole and healthy, okay? I've let go of so many bad habits, so many things that I was holding on to. You know, I had to go fight some demons, you know, and I think I've accomplished a lot. But that's the inside work that you guys don't see and the behind the scenes that I had to go through. Let me try to think of another question someone asked. I think I was asked... Um, Dang, what else was I asked? I feel like I should get online real quick and see if people ask me something. Okay. See if I get alive. Who got some questions for me? Because I need some questions. I forgot my questions. Oh, I can't even title the live anymore. But that's my mental update while I wait here. Um, I'm trying to think of some other things while I wait for people to come on because I need some questions. What were some other things people ask me? I'm really trying to think. I'm so upset because I've screenshotted them at all so I can do them today. It's so sad. Vlogmas is starting soon. Ask me some questions, guys. I meant to put that in the title. Let me put, ask me anything. But, um, yeah, so, hmm. This is bad. I can't remember anything. I'm trying to remember if there's any other updates that I have to give you guys. Um, I've talked about my business, the restaurant, the club. 
saying, oh, life has just been drifting. Talked about the photo shoot that I'll be doing soon. Um, trying to think here. I need some questions, y'all. Ask me anything. Dang! And I'm so mad that they deleted. Because they were for today. Ah, oh, that sucks. Thank you. Dang y'all, I don't know. <laughs> I'm good, how are you? I need questions for Vlogmas, guys. Like, I'm answering questions. I'm doing a life update, but I need to know what y'all want to know. Like, I've done the, I've answered where I've been. Um, answer things that are new. You know what? Let's do something. Going back to talking about my business. When I open it up, I don't think I'm going to necessarily open it up for all services yet because I still need to get some more makeup <laughs> for my clients to be able to do my clients. I've already got powders and a couple other things, but there's still some more things that I need to get. So I don't think I'm going to be opening up for makeup yet. But like waxing, um, body ritual, body ritual, body rituals, God, <laughs> um, facials, um, hey, facials. I will be doing those too. That's yeah. my brother. If y'all can hear him, <laughs> Key. Loud. Um, and what else will I be doing? Oh, microblading. Ha! Ah, that's another thing I can talk about. I am double certified in microblading, okay, baby? Microblading and shading. Come get your eyebrows done by me. That's a beautiful thing. I'm so happy. Two times certified, baby. Okay, and I'm so ready to start that because that is so much fun to me. Going back to reveling in your own beauty, you know. Something you don't have, we can put it on you, baby. If you ain't got no eyebrows, come see a girl. And I think I need to go close this door because he's being extra, extra loud. Key! <laughs> loud as hell. Interrupting my vlog. Like, jeez. Oh, shit. Okay. Can you close that door? Oh, my God. Then you got Reese in here. Can you get Reese out? No, she want to be in the video. Can you close the door and stop being loud? You stop being loud. You're being loud. You being loud. I can hear you in your room. Shush! Y'all see my life? That was a little behind the scenes. This is what I go through. This is why nothing is ever simple. <laughs> um, any great accomplishments this year? Well, my esthetician, I did say that. Um, me being double certified in microblading um i think i want to go to a lash class but i'm not sure because i already know how to do lashes but just learning other people's techniques helped me develop my own you know and then i just need a kit which i think i'm going to be purchasing a kit from my lash lady curly sue lashes haven't been to get my lashes done because the girl stays booked up okay hunty stays booked uh -huh. okay and i don't really trust everybody to be on my face anyways you know so yeah um, but yeah, I could say that's about it. Um, oh, look, the massage therapist is on here. Hey, I thought she said you needed a kid. Oh, no, <laughs> I don't need no kids, no children, no children, no children. Maybe one day, maybe like, Yeah, maybe one day, I don't know when, but maybe one day, I'm trying to start, okay? Eventually, I have some kids, because I do want some kids, but, but I'm more comfortable for them, you know? Um, dang. Oh, update, you guys probably can't see, 
But I got my piercing changed. I'm not missing a jewel anymore. It's a little uh flower. It's so pretty. I love it. I'm actually really mu very much in love with it. Here goes another question. You still talk to those girls from Carmen Carmen's boot camp? I do still talk to those girls from Carmen's boot camp. Um yeah, I do. <laughs> and you know what? They're probably in their heads when I drop these videos. They're going to be like, this girl, let's, let's see how consistent she going to be. Because she always be playing. Always be saying she going to do something. And we see her for like one, two, maybe three videos. And she be like, poof, where she at? It's okay, y'all. I promise this time. Consistency is everything. Like, I'm ready. I didn't, I cleared my schedule for this, okay? Like, it's over with. It's said and done, okay? But, yeah. <sighs> I'm excited. I'm happy. I'm excited. Like, I don't even know what to say anymore in this vlog. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, I don't even know what else to say. But, I'm ready to start this journey. Vlogmas is about to take off, baby. And I'm just hoping YouTube takes off from doing Vlogmas, for real, for real, because, yeah, I'm just for it all. For it it's all, okay? I'm ready for it all. I am making a video right now while I'm on live. <laughs> I am. Yeah, I'm giving it to my camera. <laughs> Does it look funny? Um, I do have a lot of healthy relationships. I have a lot of healthy relationships with my family and my friends. Spouse still holds a little bit of a question mark, but maybe one day I'll be able to expose that side. Just not yet. And I can't tell you guys whether I'm single taken or still looking. <laughs> so don't ask, okay? Don't ask. Uh. But yeah, I'm like so ecstatic that I can't stop smiling. But I don't have anything else to talk about. So I'm in this live. I'm going to come back and talk to y'all in just one second. Let me wrap up my video. And yeah, I'll be back in a sec. I'll see y'all in a minute. Stay tuned. It's going to come back up. Because I have some other vlogmas questions. I'll be back, okay? I love y'all. Give me one second. I'll be right back. Bye, y'all. But, yeah, so that is the update on my life and where I've been and where I'm at now. And I'm so happy. I'm so joyful. I'm so thankful. You know, like, blessings upon blessings just rolling in out of nowhere. So that means I am officially on the right path. I'm so ecstatic. Woo! <laughs> but with that being said, this concludes Vlogmas Day 1. Let's get on the journey together. Let's roll together because we only going up from here. Period. As my good auntie, T, would say. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. Drop me some girl talk, some girl talk topic questions if I can stop getting tongue-tied. And yeah, because it's long to say there. I think it's going to be about girl talk questions. I need some, some to spice it up a little bit, you know, get some girl talk in there. Let's get to know each of the inside and out. I'm such a weirdo. Don't mind me. But yeah, and let's roll together forever. And don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a cousin, sister, brother, all that. Your mother, all that. To come join me because we on the road, baby. Success is on the way. And I'm so happy and so glad that I'm back. And yeah, I love you guys and I'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>